Good morning. It is day four. We're here. Day four, man. It's I can't believe it. I actually someone asked me what day it was and I totally forgot. So I've been putting tally marks on the wall over here. So we're at day four. You already know the vibe. Breakfast is here. I've been up for a little bit. It's almost 8 a.m. But I've been up since like four, I wanna say. And just back at it doing some doing some work. Um gonna try to get this beat done today i really really want it i just been so tied up into all these new plugins and samples and i can't be, believe how i've been just sleeping on all this so i'm getting inspired breakfast time we're back to work i'm pumped right now working on this beat with the things around the room just getting inspired it's dope but lunchtime you already know the vibes i forgot i forgot what i ordered again but uh this literally looks like two chicken nuggets. Um, and then more cake, not eating it. And then we got like, I don't even know. It's like a, I don't know, chicken something. I'm just so pumped off this beat I just made that I'm gonna crush this food and get right back to it. What's good? Day four, dinner time. I moved dinner to the bed. I'm relaxing, I've been going hard all day um making this this now it's not it's not even a beat anymore it's a song um with the sounds around the room which i'm really really pumped about i'm gonna make a full video about it uh include it in here and also make a tiktok and just do the whole thing but i'm just i'm inspired right now and it's it's exciting um i started making you know some marks on the wall because i literally woke up this morning and did not remember the which day it was also I'm noticing like I'm watching Netflix and I saw someone fall and I literally said out loud like, damn, that looked like it hurt. So I guess I'm talking to myself now. So that's a thing. Um, you know, I'm new to this whole vlog thing, but you know, I'm just gonna record and you know, ramble and tell you guys what I'm doing. But even though I'm not doing much, but it's, you know, day four, dinner time. And uh, we're out here. Day number five. We're here. Um, I think I get to leave my room today. I, get, I do a, my first COVID test today. I think while I do that, I leave the room and they come clean it maybe? Either that or they clean it on the seventh day. But um, yeah, I'm waking up a little bit later, going to sleep a little bit later. So getting closer to being on track. Because, um, for instance, if I was going to sleep at 8 o'clock, because right now I'm going to sleep around like 9 maybe, when I have a show and I'm on at 1 or something, it is rough. I mean, it's rough. But luckily, by the time we have the show, I'm going to be in perfect timing. Um, I'm going to finish that beat today. I had so much fun making that yesterday. I feel really inspired. Uh, with all these new plugins and everything. I'm gonna finish that beat and then we are gonna touch on some older beats that I just haven't finished yet and we're gonna get those done, submit them, and get on track. So, day five, let's get it. Day five, we got the coffee poured up. The amount of coffee I've been drinking over here, I'm gonna set a world record, I think. I'm also, I gotta make sure they replenish this because. Got to keep going. Um, going to be eating breakfast in a little bit. Woke up today and I took a hot wash rag, put it on my face. And just reminded me, my mom used to do that all the time. Get me out of bed for school in the morning. Throw a just hot rag, boom, throw it on the face. And maybe think, you know, I've been here five days, you know, day travel. And... You know, can't leave the room and nothing like that. It made me think like, who's checking up on me? Who's texting me? Who's, yo, how is it? Uh, how, how are you? How are you doing? You know, people that do check up on you are the, are the ones that are, you know, are really there for you. And this isn't, you know, I'm not being negative and saying, you know, screw the people that aren't texting me. It's not about that. It's just, it's important to, take notice of who is checking up on you because those are the people that do care and that's my uh my morning cup of coffee in the morning that's that's the thought for today all right solid 
So, quarantine flip is done. I'm pumped about it. I think it's really cool. Now I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do for the video. It's gonna be ridiculous, but I'm gonna love it. Breakfast time. You already know. <clears throat> you already know what's going on. Did I switch it up? Oh no, same breakfast. You know what? Another day. Let's get it. All right. Totally forgot today is Tyson, Roy Jones Jr. I am excited. Just watched the worst fight I've ever seen in my entire life between Jake Paul and Nate Robinson. Seriously, one of the worst fights I've ever seen in my life. I wish I could unsee it, but we're getting ready. Tyson, Roy Jones Jr. Lunchtime. Got a little sandwich, some fries. I'm gonna try to erase the last 30 minutes of my life because it was some of the worst fights I've ever seen, and yeah. Feeling a little lazy today, can't lie. Also a little irritable. I noticed that on day five. Thought I was gonna get the corona test today. Um, looks like we're gonna be doing it tomorrow. Hopefully I'll be able to film it. Um, I'm bored. I'm bored, and I think I'm gonna shave and keep a mustache for no reason, so. Dude. Well, today's been uh, pretty uneventful. Um, just been researching about building this new PC since my computer is going. Speakers are shot, Thunderbolt doesn't work. Um, yeah, but after lunch I was feeling pretty just bored and stuff, so I ordered some more food, ended up getting a pizza. In my gut, I never order pizza outside of Jersey or New York. And y you know what, you, should, you shouldn't. You should But my photographer, Ty, told me he ordered one and then he started drawing on here. And I'm out of paper, so it's like, that's pretty much why I ordered it. But dinner's here. Um, you guessed it, I forgot what I ordered again. I'm not sure what this is. It's like a soup. It, looks, it almost looks like pho. Um, so that's kind of cool. Um, I got chocolate cake today and I haven't eaten cake once and I was feeling a little anxious earlier but I decided I'm gonna eat some cake today so let's get after it and hopefully I don't crash like I usually do I like to get some more work done after dinner so we'll see day six it's 4 30 in the morning good thing I'm not flying today because I have to check these bags in almost at the halfway mark there almost all right um had a little bit of a slow start this morning but i tweaked that beat that i said i was done with like two more times because i'm a perfectionist and you see the vibes day six it's about to be lunch time and then i'm gonna go do my first covid test here so let's get after it are you filming me I am filming you. Um, I'm out here. I'm out here and we, you're in there. What are we doing? Man, we're just catching up on how crazy life is and you are, are you, you're in prison? <laughs> am I correct? <laughs> <laughs> how, how long are you doing a bit for? There you go. Uh, how, long, how long are you doing a bit for? You know what, bro? Seven days. I get an early release and we're good on good behavior. I'm out of here. Oh, good behavior, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. You disclosed you disclose to me that you're getting food dropped off at your door and you've never seen the delivery person. Literally, what, what would make this video? Because my food should be here like any minute if my doorbell really? rang and I just go, oh, that's my commissary. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, you should just post up by your door and wait for footsteps and like catch the person. Just like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you could do it. Or wait, just leave the GoPro outside your room. You know what, bro? Like a like a security cam. I I also wanted to like check the vents because they might be watching. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They might, dude. And hey, camera if it's not show. Video, if it's not video, it's definitely audio. You know what I thought about? Like, is this what? a Harvard experiment? You know what I'm saying? Like, are they gonna stu Maybe they're studying me. So you're, you're sure that once you delete the tracer on your phone, it's gone forever? Oh, uh, I mean, 
I mean, I, I want to be sure, but you never know. What an eventful day day six has been. I went outside my room today, got a COVID test. Um, it took about two minutes. For some reason, I was expecting it to take longer. And I mean, it was under two minutes. It had to be. And as soon as it, as it was done, I was like, that's it. And they're like, yep. And I got back in the elevator and back into my room. I was like, damn, I just want to like be outside, <laughs> be out of, out of my room. Um, no exaggeration. I know you're probably not going to believe me, but as soon as I took a step out of my room, like there was like a, it was like a weird feeling looking down the hallway. It was like tunnel vision. It was weird. It was weird stepping out of my room. It felt weird. Um, that's a, how do I even describe that? Like what, what is, what does that even mean? It actually felt weird walking out of my room, which is crazy. Um, finished another remix today. That's pretty cool. Um, FaceTime with Valentino Khan. That was awesome. Talked for like an hour and a half about life and conspiracy theories and Kobe Bryant and just memories. And, you know, Hulk Gang is still, you know, going strong. So... We're just hoping for the best, and he was checking up on me, which I appreciate. So, it's dinner time. You already know the vibes. I got my push-ups in today. I figured I'm, I'm gonna stop videotaping that because you guys can just watch me do push-ups every day. What are we doing? You know what I'm saying? But I'm gonna get I'm gonna get this dinner in, and then I'm gonna get back to work. Maybe I won't go to sleep so early tonight. We'll see. Listen, man. I'm out here. I'm literally in the mountain. This isn't even my bedroom. I'm in the mountains of California, about to shoot a music video. Bobby is in Thailand. Whole gang's still united from very, very opposite ends of the earth. No and distance will separate us ever. Yeah, I'm. I'm just. I'm making sure things are good on the outside for you, Bobby. So when you get back on the outside after you do your bid, everything is handled. I love that. And, and um, yeah, day six, man, it's been real. You're a warrior for going through this, man. Half a and Hulk, man. I wish, <laughs> yeah, I got the Hulk it up, man. And I wish you the best on day seven. Who knows what it'll bring? Maybe a bird will fly outside your window. I wish, man. I haven't seen a bird in days. <laughs> Yo, day seven. Psst. Give me another 14. This is a breeze. I'm waking up feeling inspired. Let's get it, all right? I'm working. We're making music. We're doing remixes, new ideas. I'm making TikToks. What more can you ask from me? Let's get it. Whew. Lunchtime. Watching The Undoing. Show's pretty crazy. I'm really, really pumped to come out of this. We're halfway. Got a ton of new music. And I just feel excited. Um, it took me a while to get inspired during the quarantine. Um, you know, it's hard getting inspiration without playing shows. So I think the excitement to play this upcoming show and just being super focused on making music you know i'm pumped i really am every day i'm waking up with new ideas i didn't sleep great that last last night but i think tonight you know forget going to bed early i'm, I'm working tonight i'm gonna work through it and whatever time i fall asleep i fall asleep i think tomorrow or maybe later today i get my covid results back and then after that i think i get like an hour of like outside time or something like that so I'm gonna try to link up with my photographer and maybe take some pictures do some video something something but uh yeah things are moving along we're past the halfway mark let's get it i'm excited right now <clears throat> working on a million different demos but i just started working on my set for this show and i'm prepping for this set like i'm playing coachella like i'm this set is gonna be 
so crazy. I feel like it's this whole madness of a year just is all just all that anger and just everything is just coming into this set right now. And it's going to be one of the craziest sets ever. And I'm just more than excited. Damn, I'm pumped.